Good evening, Michigan. Back at you with another G Brothers review, and I'm Nico Little Bro, and I'm on my hunt, my quest, my mission to find the best beer in Michigan, maybe the world, right? And it's evening time right now. Anyways, real quick, I just want to say, how's everybody been doing out there? I hope you guys have been doing great. Everything was good. Your weekend was good. Um, mine was. I got cut. Yep, got sliced open at work. Shing, sh or shing, shing. Not as bad as I thought it was. But I had to patch it up because it keeps bleeding out. Anyways, today, you guys, we're traveling to Grand Haven, Michigan. Grand Haven, Michigan. I'm pretty sure, right? We're traveling to Grand Haven, Michigan, and we're trying out uh, Nutter Your Business Peanut Butter Stout. Yeah, Nutter Your, Nutter Your Business Peanut Butter Stout. Nutter Your Business, right? And this is from... Grand Armory Brewery. Grand Armory Brewery. Okay, is this going to be like a... Is this a play on like... Ah, oh, this is weird. Anyways, on the top of the can it says, The Right to Bear Craft. Can you guys see that? The Right to Bear Craft. The bottle's kind of cool. So this is a whole play on like the Constitution, but for craft beers. This is 5% uh, alcohol by volume. Uh, let's see, any other information... It's made with a natural flavor. All right. So it does contain peanuts. Um, none of your business. I'm not really into a lot of these flavored beers. This is from Grand Haven, Michigan. I'm really hoping this is good. I'm just really not into these kind of beers. So it's probably going to be a really quick review. Um, again, uh, Grand Armory Brewery. And I think they're Grand Haven, Michigan. I'm really hoping this is going to be good. Anyways, you guys, you know how this works. I'm going to smell it for the fanciness. Crack it open, taste it out the can to see what it's like, and then I'm going to air it out in my Italiano crystal glass. I'm buying some new glasses from around the world. Got some, I'm buying some American ones, some ones from Greece, some Japanese ones. Uh, forgot where else it was I'm buying some glasses from, so we have some different glasses on the show. Anyways. Oh, and real quick, before we do this review, remember, go visit my homeboy, Nick Scheffler, Graphic Designs, in the descriptions down below, there'll be his link, you tell him I sent you 20% off of the Graphic Designs. The price he gives you, you let him give you the price first, then you say, yeah, Benico sent me, and they'll give you 20% off. Boom, slashing it. Slashed right there. I like how that looks. Anyways, all right, so let's try this out. It's going to be a, it's going to be a dark, I don't want to taste that. So it's, this is a peanut butter stout. Ah, shit. All right, let's, let's do this, boys. Yeah. <clears throat> so, initial hit is almost like a coffee, but it's peanut butter, but it gives you that uh, initial hit that, uh, if you guys ever had, like, I don't know if you guys ever had Greek coffee. Some people call it Turkish coffee, uh, Yugoslavian coffee, Lebanese coffee. Like it's made in a little little cup and it's really gritty. You get a gritty, you get a real grittiness flavor. It is peanut butter, but it's like a bitter peanut butter. If you ever had those like organic peanut butters that are really watery at the top, you know when you get a taste of that, there's no salt in them or no sugar in them. This is what this initial hit is. After it settles. It still really sells to me like coffee. I know it's not coffee. It's peanut butter. Um, yeah, Grand Haven. That's I'm right. It is Grand Haven, Michigan. Uh, contains peanuts. Okay, where? Uh, creamy peanut butter milk stout. So I'm getting that's what I'm getting the milk. Okay, so it's that little like weird bitter milk aftertaste. Like, if you ever get an iced cappuccino from Tim Hortons and like you forgot about it and it's sitting in the refrigerator. And the next morning, like, bro, I wasted five bucks. I'm still going to, like, drink that. That's what this kind of tastes like. Anyway, let's pour it out. It's not going to be my favorite beer. I don't like these play on beers like this. But I know who's going to like this. Robert Bradley. You guys might not know him. Robert Bradley. When you see this video, go try this out. You're going to like this beer. So we look at it right here. It's a stout. Very, very dark. We understand that. Little tiny bit of a head on it, which is okay because this is a stout. You kind of see the nice, rich, dark color. 
right? It still smells like a weird off peanut butter. All right. This beer would make me sick, like really fast. If I'm pairing it, uh, ice cream, this would be really cool. It's like an ice cream float with beer. This is what this would be really good with. Um, also, real quick, guys, remember, if you guys want us to try some stuff out that you have homemade or you have any suggestions for beer or food reviews, there is an email in the descriptions down below. Send the email there. Or if you're on our Facebook page, please follow our Facebook page, page too. Uh, just um, send us a message, a personal message. Big Bro handles the Facebook page. Send them a message. We'll try your guys' stuff out, do a review on it, and it'll be a video of this. Again, not my favorite beer. I understand people who like these kind of beers. This might be really, really interesting for you. I'm not a fan. I'm not really going to drink too much more of this. It's going to make me sick. I can My stomach's already turning from doing it, but I'm not saying it's that bad in flavor. Again, it's a coffee peanut buttery taste. Um, and maybe I'm getting the coffee flavor because, you know, when you, you have coffee, people put cream and sugar in there. So maybe that's why I'm getting kind of a coffee flavor out of it. But it's mostly peanut butter milk. Uh, Grand Armor Brewery. Uh, Grand Haven, Michigan, your guys is uh, Nutta Your Business Peanut Butter Stout, right? I really like the play here that you guys have made with like the right to bear craft. I like the Constitution as much as the next guy, but hey, like I like the play, but it's you've got to have a product in here that's really good too. Uh, Grand Armory Brewery, I might try some of your guys' other beers out. I think it's pretty cool, but this is this is terrible in my opinion. This is going to get a 2.1. Yeah, it's a 2.1. I would never drink this again. There'd be no other occasion, maybe with the ice cream thing. But now that even if you're thinking about that, I wouldn't even do this with ice cream. Anyways, guys, listen. Stay safe out there. Have a beautiful summer. It's summertime's coming up. Let's do this. Have a great summer and all that kind of stuff. I am going to go to bed because it's late at night. Remember the three most important things in life. That's your faith, your family, and and beer. Not this one, but beer. All right? Stay safe, boys.